guys welcome back to my channel today i'm sharing with you my capsule wardrobe for the next month or two i didn't do one at the start of summer because i signed up for rent the runway and i've been really excited about those pieces but i feel like having a capsule wardrobe just keeps me more organized i would like to eventually get my closet down to just this but i'm not able to do that right now but I feel like I have the perfect formula for a capsule wardrobe for me. Um, you can add or take away as many pieces as you want. But right now I'm doing 20 pieces and that's just clothing. And I'll go over with you in the video the you know what type of clothing I have and what I feel like will give you the most options. But I feel like having a capsule wardrobe, it just keeps my outfits better. I, put, I look more put together. And I'm not wearing the same three shirts and jean shorts like I normally have done in the past when I didn't have a capsule wardrobe because I tend to just go for what's comfortable and you just don't look as put together. And if you like these kind of videos, give it a thumbs up. Next time I do a capsule wardrobe, I'll share it with you guys. If you're new and let's get on with the video. So for my capsule wardrobe, the formula that I've put together that works the best that I feel like I have the most options for at least two to three months of clothing is it's 20 pieces, 10 neutrals, 10 colors and prints. And what I have is in each set of 10, there's three bottoms, four shirts, a dress, and two, um, and two layering pieces. So I'm going to show you guys really quick. This is my neutral side. This is my print side. And when you want to do a capsule wardrobe, you want to have some kind of color palette in mind. I mean, you really don't have to, but having a color palette is going to get you the most mix and match outfits. So for my layering pieces, I have them here on the neutrals. I have a denim jacket and my favorite cardigan duster whatever you call it but i've showed it in so many videos and i definitely need a new one because i've had it for a couple years now but it gets me through and i just love this so it's just a solid white super long lightweight duster and then for my bottoms it's really hot here in florida i don't wear jeans much um because i'm outside a lot of the time but I have my Abercrombie mom shorts and most of the stuff is still for sale so I'll, I'll link it down below. I have my American Eagle. These are like a high-waisted distress. And then a pair of Abercrombie, Abercrombie white jean shorts. They're high-waisted. Then instead of doing one dress, I did a romper. And I'm just doing this black lace romper. It's from Francesca's. I thrifted this a couple, maybe like a year or so ago, I think. But I haven't really worn it. And that's another good thing about doing a capsule wardrobe is you're going to pull out pieces that you wouldn't normally grab, but you like and you'd want to wear them. You just forget about them. So I definitely want to get some wear out of this. And then for my tops, I have this, it's a white tank top and you should pull out like one or two or three white, black or new tank tops just to have. Um, so I have a white tank top, but over that I have this, um, it's from Love Stitch. I think I thrifted this too and I haven't really worn it. And then I just have a black and white striped tee from Abercrombie a black bodysuit from Abercrombie and then my fourth top for neutrals is this chambray sleeveless and this was from Target this isn't for sale I don't think I got it like a year ago and then for my prints and colors I have this is a black and white gingham bodysuit from Forever 21 some people would say this is a neutral but Pairing it with like leopard and stuff, I didn't think it was too neutral. So I want to definitely get my wear to this and then probably get rid of it because I've had this for a while. And then the white and beige like leopard print or snow leopard from Abercrombie. The linen crop top, I've showed you guys that this in my haul. And I haven't worn it really. And those are my prints and solid colors for tops. And then for a dress, I have 
my Love Shack fancy dress that I just got. And then this, I decided to do two dresses instead of a fourth shirt. So it's from Abercrombie. I got this probably like two years ago and I've never wanted it to get washed though. So I just wanna get a couple wears out of this, at least for the next two months. It's really comfortable and lightweight. And then for bottoms, I have a pair of linen high-waisted leopard shorts from Abercrombie. This silk, um, it's like a longer skirt. I need to steam it really quick. And the matching linen shorts to the crop top. And then for my layering pieces, I have the leopard sheer like shorts like duster from Kohl's I showed you guys. And then I have a pink denim jacket from Abercrombie. Okay, so now I have my 20 pieces and I'm going to try to put together 60 outfits.
thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.